Good morning, Miami Art Studio, and welcome back to another episode of Moss News. I'm Vicki Perez. Today's Monday, March 8th, and Moss News starts right now. Reporting from Miami Art Studio, welcome to Moss News. While the coronavirus has taken its toll on many small businesses here in South Florida, one continues to thrive. The Harmony Store, a metaphysical store here in Kendall, has continued to garner interest on social media and grow a loyal fan base. Let's find out why. The rise in popularity of social media platforms like TikTok has allowed the rapid spread of trends and ideas. In the past few months, Gen Z has seen a heightened interest in spirituality, more specifically the use of crystal, incense, and tarot cards. But many people do not know where or how to begin on their spiritual path. The Harmony Store right here in Miami is a great place to start. When you walk into the Harmony Store, you're greeted by their employees who are all well versed in things metaphysical. While all are able to tell you about the different products, some employees have more detailed information in certain areas of practice, meaning you'll be able to get an expert opinion on what to buy and how to use it. I enjoy connecting with people. Um, I often get a lot of questions about people that are curious about how to involve stones and incense and different kinds of things that we might have uh, as part of their practice or their day-to-day. Uh, -day. The Harmony Store also has a large collection of various objects that are popular within the spiritual community. Each item can be used for many different things. An evil eye bracelet, for example, is believed to ward off bad energy. Tarot and oracle cards are used for readings, a practice that gives insight on a person's life in different areas by interpreting the cards drawn for them. Incense can simply improve the smell of a room, but can also be used in a more spiritual way, like for the cleansing of crystals, aid during meditation, and clearing negative energy. No matter what product you require, the Harmony Store will have it. If you're looking to begin your spiritual journey, the Harmony Store should be your first stop. With knowledgeable employees and a wide range of products, there's everything you need to get started. With colleges releasing their acceptance decisions and seniors getting ready for the next chapter in their life, it seems that graduation isn't that far away. But with it comes the cost of caps, gowns, and graduation cords. Key Club, one of the newest additions to the array of many clubs found here at Moss, decided to raise money for the seniors last week. Here's Sofia Brito with more. On Wednesday, March 3rd, Mass Key Club held a support night at Licked Ice Cream Shop to help our class of 2021 with their final touches to walking across the stage. I'm Sophia Brito reporting for Mass News. This night was held for anyone to go and support by mentioning Mass Key Club. All of these donations are going to be put together to help with cords and induction fees. For those who went and supported, the club was giving back an appreciation for your help with community service hours to each student that went and stopped by for this delicious treat. So we got the idea for a lick support night to help pay for the induction fees and graduation cords for our seniors since we weren't allowed to collect money this year due to COVID. And we had our first support night back in December. We had it at Crep Maker and that was a huge success. So we thought doing it at Lick, which was closer to school, would help make us more money and more people would show up. And we were right and it was a great night. And I'm so thankful for everybody that came out to support us and I can't wait for the next one. Licht is a hotspot for many nearby citizens that live around the area. It is known for its spectacular creations of homemade ice cream being made in just minutes from liquid nitrogen. They give a big variety of many different flavors and mixtures of your choice. Not only are there many flavors of ice cream, but there are so many toppings that will surprise you on your visit. Thank you to everyone who came out and helped in the support night here at Licked Ice Cream Shop. The smallest actions can have the biggest impacts. These delicious treats have helped fulfill the dreams of our soon-to-graduate seniors. I'm Sophia Brito, signing off. While the NBA playoffs may seem far away, time flies and there's a lot happening before the highly anticipated game. Here's Julian Sandoval updating you with everything you need to know. None from deep. Kaboom! While just getting to the halfway point in the regular NBA season, the Miami Heat have started to push through and are now back in a playoff spot, having the sixth best record in the Eastern Conference of the league. However, 
This has not been the case the whole season, as they had struggles throughout the beginning of the season. Throughout the Heat's last 15 games, the Miami Heat have won 11 and only lost 4. This is a good run of wins, but this season has had its ups and downs for the Heat. There was a span of 14 games where Jimmy Butler was out due to COVID protocols and injuries. During this span of early games, we were able to hold up some wins but ultimately lost more games than we won, which dropped us out of the playoff run for a while. However, since Bam and Jimmy have been back, they have contributed a lot more to this team than people would think, putting up a total average of 40 points, 17 rebounds, and 14 assists per game, and their effect is felt on and off the court as they also act as leaders for the team. Though Bam and Jimmy do have some of the biggest impact on this team, we have many other young future stars that have had to step up to fill a missing piece, such as players like Kendrick Nunn, Tyler Hero, and our very own Precious Achua. These players add a strong young core that has the energy and confidence to keep the game going even when all odds seem against us. I believe the young players in the Miami Heat are the most important players because they are very talented, they bring a lot of energy, and they're easy to build around. Because of this, I believe they are playoff contenders. While this team is starting to look like they are playoff caliber again, the team is monitoring many different players to add to their roster to improve before the postseason arrives. With a healthy roster, this team can be very dangerous in the future playoffs, as last season we went all the way to Game 6 in the finals. With our heat culture and some practice, almost anything can happen in this year's NBA season. I'm Julian Sandoval, signing off. Thank you for tuning in to today's episode of Moss News, and remember to follow us on Instagram for the latest updates. Once again, I'm Vicky Perez, signing off.